Hey y'all, this is Audra Hicks with Simply Home, your Tennessee realtor, and I am here with Michael Dean Church with Fairway Independent Mortgage. And he's going to be talking a little bit about the listing side of the mortgages and 2-1 buy downs. Again, I know we talked about that in a previous video, but we're going to really hop onto that subject again today. So stay tuned because I put the real in real estate. So, on the listing side of mortgages, what does Fairway offer for us listing agents? So, we have a lot of different programs. I know you probably in this market have some listings that maybe aren't selling in two days like they used to. And the I think seller, that's about everybody. And the seller needs a little bit of help and motivation to get the clients to make an offer on the house. Okay, so what do y'all have? So, we're doing a lot of stuff where we partner with the seller and offer like a 1% credit towards closing costs for the buyer if they use us as the lender or we can apply that towards a temporary buy down which is a 2-1 or 3-2-1 buy down. Okay. Um, so basically what a 3-2-1 and a 2-1 buy down is <clears throat> it allows the seller to contribute uh, and the lender a certain amount towards a interest rate subsidy. So basically if the rate starts out at 7% you know if you do a three-year buy down then that first year your payment is going to be based on a rate that's 3% lower than the market rate. Right. So it'd be 3% lower, 2% lower, and then 1% lower. And then the fourth year would go back up to the full amount. Unless you've refied. Absolutely. Before that time. So the other good thing about a 2-1 buy down, people don't know, is that subsidy, say the seller contributes $18,000 towards that buy down subsidy, and then the rates drop in six months and we refinance that client. So if there's $16,000 left in that subsidy that we're holding in escrow at the lender, they don't lose that money. Oh, that's good. So when we call and order the payoff, if there's twelve, sixteen thousand dollars, whatever's left over in the subsidy, that gets applied towards a principal reduction. So they don't lose the money like they would if you did a straight rate buy down where okay. you paid four points to get the rate down, you know, a point. That's awesome. Yeah. Is that not on the three? <clears throat> all two all one? of them. Okay. Just, I didn't know if it was just on yeah. the two one or the no, three two either one. one. So all of them. Yep. Probably by that time, they wouldn't have as much left over Absolutely. Uh, on that part. But it's also good. Buy downs are good for people that like, say you just graduated medical school and you mm -hmm. hadn't really fully landed in the position that you're going to be in or your income's not really at the level it's probably going to be by that two time years it from now. Be. Exactly. Right. So it That's allows right. those people to go ahead and get into a house at a more affordable payment while their life and their income and all that ramp up to where they're going to be in a few years. Yeah. So that's where we see uh, on the listing side, um, the lenders are given um, credit if you use the preferred lender. You don't have to use who the preferred lender no. is, but it's all it's an incentive if you want to on Absolutely. that part. What are other good um, things going on right now in the market that we're in? Um, sellers are paying a lot of closing costs I've been seeing. So, I mean, you know, we went for what, three years and you couldn't get a seller credit to save your life? And now I did during that time. It you're was, lucky. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but it's strategic on how you write yeah, up the offer absolutely. too. Absolutely. Yeah. But so I mean I've seen some as high as thirty thousand dollars lately, like where the sellers paid oh, thirty thousand wow. dollars towards buy downs and closing costs and everything else. So yeah. it's a great time to buy right now. It is. This is uh, the buyer's market right now. So right. it's a sweet spot before we get back into the the interest rates going down and multiple offers again and paying over um appraisal buy the house and date the rate exactly that's what i say yeah yeah you you go ahead and marry the house but you date the rate over here exactly. well that don't sound right does it <laughs> 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 but you got to think outside the box during every Absolutely. every market that we're in yep and uh but now's a sweet time to buy Absolutely. it is you're in that sweet spot maybe a month or two and then we'll start seeing rates go down and then go back to well i mean just the one percent drop that we've had in the last 30 days i've noticed a huge uptick in contracts and people that are applying to get a mortgage mm -hmm. so if we yeah. get another percent drop it's going to be a feeding frenzy i know which which means again that with the lower inventory unless we see a lot more inventory come on the market during yeah. that time too um you know, people might need to sell their homes. Who yeah. knows? So um, we might see that. If not, then we're going to be back in the feeding frenzy. So. so don't sit on the sidelines waiting for a crash. It's not going to happen. You cannot have a mortgage or a real estate crash when there's a 
shortage of inventory. And that's good that you said that. A lot of people are, have been waiting for that for the past few years. It's not going to happen. Mm -hmm. Especially not Middle Tennessee. Right. I've been trying to tell them that, so. so good you said it. Yeah. From a Sometimes mortgage I just want to shake them. <laughs> <laughs> you don't do that, I promise. Okay. <laughs> So hopefully that helps y'all uh, feel better about buying right now and getting seller concessions and things. And also on the listing side, um, you know, listing agents, we can yeah. offer that and as an incentive and uh, see more people being able to get in homes. So right now is a buyer's market. So if you're ready, now's the time to buy. So let's go. Yeah, let's do it. And if you like my content, please like and subscribe and share with your friends and family. Until next time, Merry Christmas. We'll see you soon. Bye. Bye.